Hey y'all and welcome back to Organically Design. I'm Lindsay and today I wanted to challenge myself to make a dinner all from Dollar Tree. And the big challenge on top of that, because I know it's actually pretty simple to do, is the fact that it is a gluten-free meal. So I am gluten-free because I have celiac disease and so let me get started on these gluten-free ingredients that you can find at the majority of your Dollar Trees. I really did try to make sure of that. I love saving money um, and so if I can find little things here and there to get at the Dollar Tree to save me a buck, I definitely will do so. So first things first, all right. So we've got to have our meat and y'all know that most Dollar Trees don't sell just a basic chicken breast or anything like that. Um, most of them are breaded nuggets or breaded um, tenders or something like something along those lines. So I picked up the Kreider Premium White Chicken in a can. So I got a few of these because I am feeding a family. So I picked up three of those. And we're gonna drain those and cook those. And um, a few ingredients that I did not pick up at the Dollar Tree are spices because I did already have them at home. And I know these are spices that most people have at home. It's gonna be um, paprika, uh, garlic, salt, and you're gonna do cumin and chili powder. And then if you have your own like gluten-free like um, mix, I we love using this meat church barbecues dia de la fajita so um that's what i'll be using but if you want to make your own it's going to be chili powder garlic salt cumin paprika and a little bit of um cayenne to taste it just depends on how what kind of heat you're wanting to bring so that's what i'm going to season my chicken with in the pan um and then i as far as toppings for the tacos, we love jalapenos. Um, me and my husband do. The kids skip out on that. So I picked up this green briar jalapeno slices. And then we're also going to be doing a pepper stir fry. This is in the frozen section. This is TJ Farms. So, got that. And then of course to go on top is a Mexican blend cheese. And one of the things that I could not find and I, I never see it mine is sour cream. Um, but you can, I mean, if you're going cheap, Walmart has it. So then next I picked up the Vigo saffron yellow rice as a side um because i want it to be a little heartier than just eating plain tacos and then after that cooks i'm going to add in and heat up some rotel drained and add it to the rice to kick it up a notch and add a little veggies to that of course you can put your jalapenos in that or your pepper stir fry in that and the pepper stir fry has three different color bell peppers in it is what it advertises on the outside i have not opened it up yet and onions and then last but not least, you have to have the shell for the tacos. These are a Greenbrier product as well, 12 taco shells. And there's only two products, corn flour and corn, corn oil. So it is gluten-free. So this is all gluten-free, celiac friendly. So let's get started cooking. I am so excited to see how this turns out. And this is going to be an awesome little lunch for me um but a little dinner for the rest of my family so let's get
Now for the ultimate test. The yellow rice has a really good flavor without the rotel, but I like that extra spicy kick on top. Now, for my kids, I would just, probably the younger two, I would just give it to them with just the rice. But, good. Now, taco time. Taco time. Hold on, I need another one to be sure. Mm. With the jalapeno, so good. Now, I skipped out on the sour cream because I didn't want to cheat on using something that I did not get at the Dollar Tree. Um, the spices, of course, I kind of cheated on, but they're all stuff that you can find, or seasonings, not stuff, seasonings that you can find at the Dollar Tree. But y'all, this, so good. And... For just all the ingredients were just nine dollars. So for my family of five, that's only a dollar eighty a person for a full meal. And really each person could get two tacos. And this is a lot of rice. Let me show you this big pot of rice. Look, I have plenty. Plenty of rice and plenty of chicken. Sometimes just like the veggies and the taco, the cheese and the jalapenos and the rice. So I could do a veggie taco too if I wanted to. But y'all, so good, gluten free, celiac friendly for my little celiac self. And only nine dollars at the Dollar Tree. Everything from the Dollar Tree turned out so good. This meal turned out so good. I was a little skeptical that the canned chicken was gonna be not great. But once I cooked it thoroughly and um, then add the spices to it and everything, it tastes really, really good. It's not dry, um, but yeah. So y'all, Leave me alone. I'm going to eat this rest of this plate. As always, stay organically you. And y'all have an amazing rest of your day. And keep a watch out for more videos like this. I love to do things with cleaning, organizing, and creating. Such as creating a Dollar Tree gluten-free meal for my little celiac self. So be sure to hit that thumbs up if you like this video. And hit that subscribe button for more little fun little tips and tricks when it comes to all things cleaning, organizing, and creating. If I don't get off here, um, my food's going to get cold. So.